I'm Ron from Coleno, your go-to platform for accounts receivable integrated with NetSuite. Today, I'll walk you through the process of crediting a notarized customer return. You can issue a credit memo to a customer for notarized return. It matches the amount they paid for the item. Customer credit memos serve as records of credit reducing the balance the customer owes. By generating a credit from the return, you ensure the customer is properly credited for the returned item. So I will go to transactions, customers, issue return authorizations, yep, and then list. So the one you're looking for should have a status uh, pending refund. So you can see the column status here and we're looking for a pending refund one. I can see this one has. Perfect. So I will click on view. So quick note here, if you find this tutorial helpful, please make sure to like the video. I would be super grateful. And then on this authorization page, you can click on the refund button. On this page, it opens the credits memo. You can check at the bottom the quantities and amounts to make sure that everything matches what you are expecting. And then when you're happy, you just click save in the top left. The credit can then be applied to the customer's account or refunding depending on the situation. For more details on applying or refunding credits, please check the relevant guide. Finally, don't forget to subscribe and check the comments for more NetSuite tips. Bye-bye.